Alright, so we need to figure out what is going on in here. Oh shit, that looks like a demon. I don't know, I don't really know if we could take out anything with the demon portal or not. Let's collect that. Need ten more to uncover the story. The Bell Tower Banshee. I don't know whether or not there's a Banshee in this area or not though. Alright. Clearly there's going to be if we're, if we're able to hide there. Usually means that there is a Banshee lurking somewhere. Where that somewhere is, I'm not quite sure though. What is this? It seemed like there was another clue there. Organ dedication plaque, Salem's history 2 out of 15. I'm going to try to collect all of them, at least as best as I can. Alright, but like those barrels just before, I don't think there was any more barrels, but I'm going to try to not... I'll try collecting them as much as I can, but for some of them, I'm probably just not going to be able to get. Oh, shit. Well, I guess that railing didn't really do me any good, huh? Alright, I'm going to try to get all of them that I can get around here. I don't think there's any way I can destroy those things there. What is this? Clue? Nope, Julia's thoughts can't stop loving him. It almost seems as though... What's up with this crow? It almost seems as if, like, when we're done with this and we go to heaven or whatever place that we're supposed to be going to, it seems as if she might say, you know what? I'm sorry, but you're not the guy that I want. What is this all about? Where is she? Wasn't there a clue about the church and the apartment? What clue that... It, wow, there's... There's a lot. Um... Are we ready to answer this? I think we are, but... My only lead... I know that there was one... Was it that one? No. The church. Father, do you have anywhere that I could stay just for a little while? Oh, of course, dear. The church is always here now. I think we have an old attic you can stay in for as long as you like. Staying in the attic? I better go check it out. I highly doubt that she's still in the attic, but I never know, right? Another axe? Oh, okay, so this is actually, that's actually one of like the side mission things, is those things. She's praying what I'm thinking. It's getting dangerous out there with all these murders. There's one promise I never regretted. How strange that we got married in this church and this girl is hiding in this church as well. I think there's more to this story than just the bell killer. The bell killer. It's kind of creepy. If you guys can see, there's a man and then there's a woman right across where the bricks are at right there. It's kind of freaky. At least I'm not alone. A lot of prayers going up right now. Not just hers. Alright, I was hoping that they might have had some important... Whoa, how about this person? If there's someone up there, please start protecting us. Alright, what is this back here? Oh, it's just a crow. Alright, so I don't know whether or not I need to possess these people at all. This one seems like it's... Whoa, what is, what is he holding? Is he holding a, a shoe? At least it's well lit, and there are people around. I can't smell good. If it smells perfect. It smells like her. So you just decided to help yourself to her closet? No, 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 no. The ones in her closet were too new. Besides, she knew someone had been in there. I waited until she threw them out. You know, I was always good at waiting and watching. Sometimes she would look around like she could feel me watching. And if she caught you, then what? Your whole world would come crashing down. Why? It never has in the past. I deal with her the way I dealt with the others. And then I move on to the next one. Moving on in this place might be harder than you think. 
Really, that was it. I thought there was another option that we'd be able to choose. I guess we ended up choosing the one that was most important. Alright, so apparently there's an attic in this place. Whoa, look at how creepy that is. You see those two up there just, like, staring at me? Freaky. Really puts a new spin on whether or not, like, you know, you're getting married or something like that, or you're in a church, and you think, like, what if this is real? Ugh. Gives me the, gives me the creeps. Just thinking about it, you know, like, I live in an apartment, what if somebody died here and there was just somebody staring at me right, right next to me in the chair? Kind of freaky. Kind of freaky to think about. Can we go through that wall? Apparently we can. Alright, let's go over this way. Let's see, we probably can go through this door. Yes, we can. Let's reveal that. I'm pretty sure that these demon spawn things right there, I'm not able to get rid of them at all. And they just... Nave. At first I thought that said save. I was like, really? There's a door that says save? But anyway, like I mentioned, I don't think that I'm able to get through, uh... Through, like, the demon pit thing. Whoa. What the fuck? Can I possess him and get through? I'm thinking that's what's gonna... That's how we when do it, I think. Down, I'll go ask her why she needs to stay here. Alright. See you, buddy. Thank you for getting us over. Must be up there. No. Look at that kitty cat. Alright, so. I think there's still more that we can check out. Yes, there is. Awesome. I was gonna say, I don't think we need to go directly up there. At least I was hoping we didn't need to. So it's pretty cool. I really love the story elements in this. So observe. So I guess you took this elevator to go up to the uh, attic? Going up. Is that really it? Alright. That wasn't quite what I expected it to be, but... Fair enough. Possess the black cat. Oh, man. How cliche is that? Although I suppose they don't really say that black cats are possessed, but they're just bad luck. Alright, I'll probably possess the cat here in a second. Meow, meow, meow. Only need six more to go, and I think we'll be good in that. Whoa, what is this? So I wonder why there's so many random saws around. Because I'm thinking that the bell tower killer had used them then. At least that's kind of what I get out of it. Meow. You can use L and run, possessing the cat. Some ledges can be jumped. Shoot, cat, get out of here. I don't think they're gonna do anything. Can I jump? Those air vents okay? Oh, yes, sir, just regular maintenance. These things are big enough for small animals to go hiking in. So we just have to make sure none of the little critters get trapped in there. Well, what happens then? This is probably the coolest game. I'm able to possess a cat. That... That is just awesome. Okay, I don't like the sound of that. Nope. That kind of scared the shit out of me, too. Look at that. Just look at it. Call that pure. Bullshit. Oh, shit. I know he's gonna try and get me. Is he gone? Nope. Alright. He's back on his patrol. I think he is. I wanna try to take this guy out. Did I get him? No. That was some bullshit. I wonder what it would happen if he found me while I was possessing one of the people. I don't know if he'd be able to, like, they kill the person or what the deal is.
Alright, so, I'm back with the cat. I don't know how... I think I could jump. I gotta be able to jump. Right? I don't know... Oh. <laughs> oh, there we go. Sweet. Oh yeah, they're quite the fairy tale. They weren't high school sweethearts, you know. Everyone thinks they were, but they just seem. I don't know what the purpose of having the cat jump up top here really does. This would never happen in my kitchen. But he met Shelley down. All right, back to the cat. Boston. He travels thousands of miles across the freaking ocean to meet the love of his life. All right, I want to see what's past this door before. All right, I know what's. Find out what's over there then. That's just the demon again. Ooh, where is this? I don't know, Angie. Brian's a lovely boy, but I worry about his family. Well, his mother does seem to be a bit of a heartbeat, but Brian's worth it. Yeah, I think so too, dear. It's just that Shelley didn't grow up around boisterous people, and I worry about the pressures of their relationship. Oh, Sheila, they'll be fine. You know they'll have a long time to life together. Oh, I'm sure you like You've been her best friend since what? Fourth grade? <laughs> I think in some ways you know her better than I do. I hope my wedding isn't this stressful. Oh, trust me, lady. It's going to be just as stressful. Why can't everyone do it? Alright, so I kind of think that was meaningless. Not too much behind that. Ooh, but there is a clue. That's kind of what I'm trying to do here, is I'm just trying to figure out all as much clues as I can possibly get for that, uh... Can I go over there? Apparently I can't. I'm just trying to avoid that one demon as best as I can. Considering there's really nothing even over there that I need to do. Alright, so the creepy contraption thing is going to be over there. Part of me feels as if the next part's going to be, um... Getting the cat. I think we might have found all of the the saws that we need to find for for down here at least poltergeist that shit nobody's even in the room so it's not creepy really alright oh shit sure let's collect that here we go so I think there's only what two left after this one right yeah just two more I'm assuming that the rest now are just going to be upstairs or whatnot. So I don't know whether or not if I possess the cat I can go through the, like, demon pit thing. Alright, gotta get back to the kitchen. Where'd the cat go? There it is. Run, kitty, run! Alright. Alright, well the issue now is where can I even go? Alright, I guess we do go through here. Wants us to go through here. I don't like that. The demon's passed here. Right? Yeah. Is he gonna find us? I don't know. Well, we're gonna figure out whether or not he can see us or not. I don't know where we're really supposed to go. Still can't. Unreal. Whoa. Now I gotta possess that cat all over again too. Finally, I've gotten rid of that stupid demon. Anyway, moving on. Finally, continuing to the fun part of this game. is the cat. Best part of this game. There we go. So it's really weird the way the jumping mechanic works for the cat goes. Because you can use either the right trigger or the left trigger bumper, but... Rather strange. What's over here? I think we already were in this room. Yeah, we were. You know what? I want to do this. I want to come over here and meow at him. Yeah. Let's do it. 
<laughs> uh, if I was a person and saw a black cat in a vent meowing at me, I would be freaking out. Be like, what the hell is going on? Unfortunately, I think that's the only place that I can go, though. Is Right? Let me just double check. I can't go through there. I guess we have to come out here as the cat. Really? Nothing? Alright. Here we go, and we're outside. This is I think this is where we had to had to be anyway. I don't really know where we're supposed to go though. I think the attic, right? Getting ready to unpossess the cat just to figure out Oh here we go. At least I think this is where we're supposed to go. That guy is vacuuming that spot like a champ. Nobody should spill anything in that spot. What is this? I have never seen a cat scale a wall by doing this in my life. But I'm alright with uh, letting that be the first time. Alright, can I de I can't depossess the cat. So, I mean, we gotta be on the right trail. I guess we go on the tree branch? Holy shit. This is one crazy cat. Luckily, at least this is an easy way to the attic. Alright, kitty, jump. Do we go down there? Do we go back on the tree? No, I think we just jumped down again. Oh, the crazy kitty thing again. Look at how this cat is jumping. If I saw a cat do that in my life, I would be fucking freaked out. Get to the attic. I think we can depossess the cat now. Alright, kitty. Thanks for uh, letting us use you. It's kind of creepy how there's a dude right there. There she is, finally. Why do I always lose my keys when I need to leave? 